Other unique Texas Skyway products include exhaust pipe extension, exhaust pipe fairing, intake air and nose gear fairing, JPI EDM Model 700, 800, and 930 engine monitors, and a starter warning indicator system. As the fleet of aircraft age, more starter solenoids are allowing moisture to seep in, causing corrosion to the core of the electromagnet in the solenoid. Now, this may cause that solenoid to stick closed, thus keeping the uh, starter energized after the engine is running. By installing the starter warning kit, the pilot is now able to monitor via a small light on the instrument panel whether that starter is engaged or disengaged. When you turn the key to start the engine, the starter solenoid closes, power goes to the starter, the engine cranks, you release the key, and you hope that the starter solenoid opens. Sometimes it doesn't. We've had a few customers that have installed this starter warning light and have already called and told us it saved burning up the starter, the battery, and sometimes the alternator. There's one case in, in Dallas years ago where the starter solenoid stuck in a Cessna 182 RG. The starter was still drawing current from the alternator. Uh, the alternator was still charging at a high rate. Let me start over. There's one case in Dallas years ago in a Cessna 182 RG. What happened was the engine started, but the starter solenoid stayed closed. It drew current from the battery. The alternator was trying to keep the battery charged. The battery exploded. The alternator ran away. It burned up the wiring to the radios. The cockpit is full of smoke. And now the pilot has no electric system. This was a Cessna 182 RG, which has an electric motor to turn the hydraulic pump to lower the landing gear. Fortunately, the pilot was able to pump the gear down with a hand pump. He landed okay, but realized the starter solenoid being closed, stuck closed, is what had caused the problem. Texas Skyways holds 50 STCs for various engine modifications and related products. For example, the uh, Texas oil drain sump. This is a typical 0470 engine that comes off the majority of the systems we work on. As you can see, there's quite a bit of deposits and old oil that just stays trapped in there over the years. There's things floating in there. You notice that the lowest point of the sump is actually up in this area here, so a certain amount of oil and deposits remain trapped in there. This is the Texas Skyway sump uh, with our total drain uh, system on it. You notice that the factory drains are still there, but we've also added this drain in the center to help uh, get rid of those deposits that normally would you saw on the other sump and, and actually help extend the life of your engine up to 500 hours just because your oil is staying cleaner and you're doing better maintenance to your aircraft. This is our quick drain device that we install on all of our total drain sumps. It enables you to hook up a hose and drain your oil very easily from the bottom of the aircraft.